I'm uh, Bob Henriquez. I'm running for uh, Hillsborough County Property Appraiser countywide. Well, I was born and raised here in Tampa, um, four or five generations back. Uh, my, my whole family uh, grew up here. Uh, uh, my mother's family moved here from, uh, my, my grandfather was a lector in the cigar factories, uh, moved here from uh, when he was about six years old from Spain. On my father's side, my great-grandfather uh, moved from Cuba to Key West, Key West to Tampa following the cigar trade. and. Um, had his own uh, cigar factory here in, in West Tampa and was the last mayor of West Tampa before it became part of the city of Tampa. Um, I'm also, I, I, I was born and raised here. I, I went to uh, Tampa Catholic High School, graduated in 1982. Uh, uh, my undergraduate degree is from Princeton University. Uh, I've done graduate work at the University of South Florida as well. Um, have been a head football coach at Tampa Catholic High School for many, many years. Uh, also coached at Jefferson High School. It's been my labor of love uh, for many, many years. I, was a community planner, a senior planner with Hillsborough County for 11 years, uh, and then the Builders Association hired me to be their government affairs coordinator, uh, and then I ran for office for the State House in 1998 and served from 1998 to 2006 uh, until I was termed out, um, and uh, since then I've worked for a number of engineering firms um, in the private sector as, a, as, a, as doing business development, uh, public affairs, uh, as well as project management. Uh, and then I spent three years, um, most recently, with the Department of Children and Families. I was appointed uh, by uh, the Governor uh, Charlie Crist uh, under the, the, uh, the administration of, of uh, Bob Butterworth and served as the circuit administrator uh, running the operation in Pasco and Pinellas County. Multi-million dollar operation with uh, hundreds of employees. Uh, incredible uh, opportunity to, to, to help uh, you know, children and families, aging services. Uh, you name it, and it was a challenging time, as you know, with the economic times that we had to be working in that department, uh, overseeing food stamps, aging services, child welfare, um, and I think it uniquely qualifies me for the position I'm running for. Well, I think it's, it's really, uh, even before my birth, my, my lineage, having, having had a great-grandfather that was the last mayor of West Tampa and, and had been a city councilman in, in, in West Tampa, we heard stories about him. Um, my, my cousin Lou Delapart was a state senator. Um, and and uh, was just the icon of the family, an icon, an icon in this community, um, uh, frankly. Uh, and so I think I really looked up to those. Those I looked to those stories and looked up to to to, uh, to my cousin Lou. Uh, my family, my father was a house painter, um, you know, a painting contractor in town for many years. And uh, so I really didn't necessarily come from the silver spoon side of the family, but at the same time, uh, I always had a passion for community service and public service. Uh, going back to when I was uh, in fifth grade, we went on a field trip. I tell the story all the time to the county commission uh, office or the chambers and, and watched uh, the county commission uh, operate. And I remember telling my best friend on the way back uh, uh, to school, I want to work there someday. You know, and, and uh, I always had an, a, 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 you know, a passion for, for academics, for education. Always wanted to go away to school and had a great opportunity first to my family to graduate from college. Uh, and I had a chance to go to a, you know, Princeton University, an Ivy League school. But I always wanted to come back and give back to this great community um, that, that my roots are so deep in and that I care so deeply about.